Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenner, and today we are playing as the Pope Man, the Papal State, here in Europa Universalis 4. We are letting our vassal Brittany colonize up here in North America, so we're just going to let that go. Uh, we're going to keep letting France do its thing over here in Asia, and we are going to focus on colonizing in here, in the inland of Africa, where there's what, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... Uh, there's another one there, 10. That's probably about it. Uh, we're, we're not really going to get around over here. And there's some more... We might get down here to, to Ethiopia, though. There's some more shit down here. Nubia, whatever you want to call it. Uh, but to do that, we're going to have to take some land uh, either from the Ottomans or the... Auto, or the, the Ottomans or Oman, either one. Probably both. They're both kind of douchey. They're very douchey. Douchey. Okay, goodbye, Uncle Touchy. Yeah, lots of idiots in the stream today. That's that's normal, though. Okay, what missions do we have? Accumulate money? Nah. Prove relations with Britain? That's impossible. Claim Memmingen? I really don't think there's any point in claiming anything off of Austria. God, he and his vassals are just so horrible. Oh, goodness. Out of Spain, Norway, and Sweden. Hmm. Britain's uh, bureaucratic despotism, good for you. Do we have any actual allies? I mean, I'm sure we do. we got to have something, right? Okay, alliance with the Teutons, good. Alliance with Burgundy, okay. They're not my first choice for an ally, but whatever. Alliance with Bohemia, okay, good. And the Netherlands, oh, okay, good. So, yeah, we have some strong allies, especially the Netherlands. That's a nice strong ally. Uh, are we the leader in this war? No. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, if we're going to be at peace, let's just fast forward a bit here. Let things roll. Uh, we're engaging the enemy in Brno. Huh? Brno. Where the hell is Brno? Why are we engaging an enemy in Brno? Oh, Borno! <laughs> ah! Bruno's over here in Switzerland, right? Yeah, right there. Bruno. Eh, whatever. That's not the right dude. Anyway, let's go ahead and spend some of our admin points, because we're 15 years ahead in admin tech. Holy shit. Spend all that points. Uh, revolts. That's not fantastic. Yeah, hey, how about you uh, deal with that? Do we have any generals for you? We have you. You're busy. And we have you, who is not busy. All right, well, I'll put you over here. You guys can auto-hunt all day long. There you go. Have fun, dude. Yeah, enjoy that. We have all of our uh, military at half funding right now, a little less than half, so that we can save up some cash and uh, spend as many of these admin points as we can. Constables are done. I'm only going to worry about European stuff. Workshops are pretty much... They're done. Oh, over here in Kaffa. Done. Great. Lovely. 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 Yep. Engage that bastard. Mmm. Ooh. Trade steering plus 10 for five years? Okay. We're not really using our diplos. We're annexing Serbia. Great. What other vassals do we have? Well, I mean, besides France and Brittany. I know about those. Okay. Serbia, Brittany, France, and Tripoli. Ah, Tripoli, yes. Well, Tripoli we can keep feeding, but we don't have to. We could just annex Tripoli and um, spit out the Mamluks. If we spit out the Mamluks, they can eat up some of this land over here. They have cores on shit. Um... I guess that's a decent idea. You know, Oman has no allies. We need a CB on Oman. Can we fabricate a claim on you? No, we can't. Oh, man. I would love to just come over here and eat up some Omani lands over here. Shoot. Well, how long do we have a truce? Oh, we don't have a truce with the Ottomans. Ooh. Could declare war on them. Baluchistan, Jonpur, Nogai, Kazakh, Turin. Huh. You know what? I think we'll annex Tripoli first. There's just no re- Well, no, that's not true. They still need to core this shit. Well, let's get relations up, at least. Even if we don't annex them right away. 
They really need to core tune us, or else we'll have to pay for it. They changed the game in 1.2 so that you um, you still have to core shit on your own if your vassal doesn't do it before you annex them. How's things going in the new world, eh? You guys are having fun up here? Yeah? I wish you could just drag some text across here, call it Papal Mexico, or uh, Papal America, or whatever. Papal California. You know, why not? Why the hell not? Okay, you guys are still hunting. Very good. Cores are growing really quickly. About half done down there in Africa. Magistrate resigns. Oh, come are we over our limit? We are over our limit. You guys hurry up with these damn cores. And Tripoli, you, you little bastard. You need to core Tunis. Oh, there he's coring it! Finally! <gasps> He needs to core Tunis so I can sell him uh, Al Jazeera. Because that'll get me under the limit. Oh man, he's freaking coring. Oh, that's, good. that's great. So starting in, what, February 1st? Let's see how long it takes him to core. Because the AI cores in a lot less time than uh, players do. Because these cores in Africa we started years ago, right? They're only at 60%. Oh, we found Sweden's navy. Hey, where's my navy? Here you go. And we have an admiral, too. Well, let's party. Everyone party. Come on, Navy, get there in time. We're not going to get there in time. No. We lost all 54. We lost all 54 ships? Really? Well, I guess we need to build 54 more ships. I cannot believe we lost 54 trade ships right there. can only rebuild 22. Wow, they're expensive. Actually dropped off some soldiers too. Is he running away? No, he's just going to stay there. I better not run away, dude. Stay right there. I'm coming. We're going to have a party. Here we go. Yeah. Sup, Sweden? Sup, you little cocksucking faggot? Oh, oh, look, you dead. Look who dead now. Who dead now? Who dead now? You know what? I think I know where you live, Sweden. I know. Oh, I don't even have to go up there. I was going to say we can go up there, but I don't even have to go up there. Everyone else is already up there. I don't even have to worry about it. All right, just go home and sit in Rome. Just chill. You know what? Not even Rome. Go sit in uh, Sardinia. So you can easily get anywhere. Oh, man. He killed 54 of my trade ships. Like it ain't no thing. Can you believe that? What a bastard. You a bastard, Sweden. He's got troops sitting over here, too. Well, as long as he doesn't take... Um, Tunis, then I don't care, because that would stop the coring process. You can't see coring pro progress for some reason. It'd be nice if you could see coring progress. Oh well. Okay, ships are ready to go. Uh, get rid of you and you, and all the rest of you can group up in... Yeah, go to Rome. Group up in Rome. Now let's build some more ships. Mwah. Oh man. So expensive. Do we really need to bring anyone down here? He's actually sieging pretty quickly. Uh, I guess we can. How many can I... I can bring 40 guys. Alright, well, let's take... Um, wow, 48. Let's just take 28. Well, no, those are... That's 28 cannons? Why did I build 28 cannons? I don't know. I really don't know. But we did. So let's take... What? Nine? And you guys can split in half. And then we'll kind of just pick up whatever. Whatever. We'll go smash that idiot. Stupid Sweden. Hey, we court Chumash. Very nice. Stupid Sweden. Okay, you get a general. Get on the boat. And let's go kill Sweden. Yay! I don't even have to fund them because it's like 40 to 9. Now, we can tech up our Diplo, but we are ahead, right? We're three years ahead. It's okay, though. We have so many points. Just do it. God, it's such a waste. Okay. Go, my minions! K 
Kill them all. Oh, how do you like that, Sweden? How do you like that, eh? Oh, the Ottomans are at war. Oh my god, he's getting rocked. Establish cantonments. Yeah, and he actually got squished. Love, love light. Alright, so the Ottomans are at war with what? Persia and... Ottomans are at war with Crimea? Really? Oh god, the Ottomans are gigantic. And their allies are amazing. You have the Timurids in a PU, don't you? Yeah, he's got the Timurids in a PU. That's so shitty. Can't believe you have the Timurids in a PU, Ottomans. Not cool, bro. We have more troops than Russia. Wow. Um, yeah. About that. <laughs> oh man, the Ottomans have level 28 military tech. So do we. Uh, Russia is actually neutral? Really? They want an alliance? Russia wants an alliance. <sighs> we should get an alliance with Russia again. I miss having an alliance with you, Russia. I really do. But uh, we actually don't like them. So we can ask for, uh, can ask for access, I guess. That will improve our opinion of them. But it would be better if they would actually invest some time and effort into our opinion. And they don't seem to be investing... They are not investing into the opinion of anyone. So Russia don't give a fuck. That's essentially what they're saying. There we go. Now we can get an alliance. Alright, come on Russia. I know you want it. I know. I want it. I want it willingly. Come on. There we go. Yeah, we probably shouldn't start a war while we have um, crippling overextension. But we are almost done getting our overextension under control, so I guess it's okay. Alright, ships meet up. And we got an alliance with Russia again. Fantastic. They're at war with Crimea and Persia. Wait a minute, are you allied with the Ottomans? No. But you are allied with the Ottomans in a war. Are you shitting me? Are you fucking... Oh, it's a different... It's a separate war. Ooh. Russia, did you start your own war against Crimea? Is that what's going on? Yes. Russia is attacking Crimea. Okay. Well, this is actually a really good time to go to war with the Ottomans, except for our crippling overextension. So hopefully this course will finish soon. And uh, hopefully we can get out of this war with um, Ukraine and move on. Because this shit is... Wow. This shit is wow. Now, it said we had some rebels. Where's the rebels? I guess they were fake rebels. They weren't real. It's not real. Okay. 35 ships. Now, where were you patrolling? Or what were you patrolling? Let me see. Okay, we got 100% on Roma. That's great. We're collecting 61 ducats there. Uh, how are we in Tunis? Um, what are we doing? We're not doing anything in Tunis. Where's our merchants? We're in Chesapeake Bay. We're collecting over there. Let me see Chesapeake Bay. Oh! Really? We have, like, no strength here. Wow. Quebec has the most strength here. Let me see the node. Hmm. We just need more ships. Oh, man. Quebec has so much trade power here. They're getting 54 from provinces, and then they're getting shrewd commerce practice. They have a, uh, an advisor, and then they have trade efficiency plus 40. We have overextension. Oh, overextension! But that will get fixed up real soon here. I didn't realize overextension mattered for trade income. That's good to know. You learn something new every day. Okay, what about Venice? We're collecting in Venice, right? I assume so. Oh, Venice is fine. What about... Um, where else are we collecting? Mexico. We're collecting in Mexico? Really? I guess it's actually worth eight ducats. Yeah, that's not bad. Why is there no overextension penalty over here in Mexico? Well, that's weird. Huh. Um, 35 more trade ships. Well, you know what? Go to Mexico. Fuck it.
So now our armies are 27, 12, and 18. That's not bad. Still, it's probably way too many cav, though. You don't need 11 cav in an army. Ah, well, whatever. Oh, man, more wars with Persia. Oof. Hurry up, overextension. We have enemy of enemy bonus. We're allied. Improve relations. We can't do a marriage. We're a little bit of the wrong type of government for a marriage. But, uh, oh, we can offer him access. There you go. I don't improve his opinion a bit. As soon as Serbia is done annexing, I think that's the time to declare war. Get him, Eugenius. Eugenius the fifth. He's a badass. Aw, oh, we lost conquest on Britain. Aw. Oh. Why are there particularists in Al Jazeera? I mean, come on. Can't we all just get along? Okay, maxed relations with uh, with Russia. That's fine. Ah, could get relations with Spain, I guess. Not sure it's worth it, though. They hate our guts. Britain hates us. Austria really hates us. Uh, Bohemia, we can get a little bit. Uh, the Teutons, we can get the Teutons up a bit. Kill them all. There you go. Back on the boat. Home we go. So is he done coring? Oh yeah, he's done coring already. It took him like a year and a half. That was so fast. Alright, hurry up and uh, finish the war. Since we're out of the war, we can sell him Al Jazeera. Hey, cores are coming in. Great. Okay, the war's over. Let's sell... Al Jazeera to Tripoli. There you go. Enjoy. Now you core it. There goes Gao. Damargam and Borno. Come on, Borno. Hey, Chinook is self sustaining. Fantastic. Alright, Chinook. Core that shit. And there's nothing else up here that we're going to go for. We'll let Brittany do the rest. Uh, we could. No, there's nothing really else over here, is there? Well, there's Easter Island. You know, even the Easter Island's gone. France and Brittany have split up <laughs> New Zealand. That's awesome. There's a few more colonies over here to take. I'll let my vassals do most of that. Let's do Africa. Africa. Whatever. Let's block off Spain. Block Spain. Le old cock block. Le old cock block. Where's my frickin' army? Don't tell me you're walking around. Oh, he is. Yeah, he's going through. He's going through uncolonized wastelands. You stupid bastard. Well, whatever. I should probably colonize those too. Okay. So how's things going? Are you coring this thing yet? No. Come on, core it. I'm proud of you for coring Tunis. Okay, you you make me proud. Very proud for coring Tunis. Russia seems to be having no trouble invading Crimea, of course. Crimea is actually invading the Ottomans. But the Ottomans are still winning the war because Persia is a weak target. Oh god. Yeah, Russia is just beating the shit out of Crimea. White peace. Really? Why you white peace, Russia? Why you white peace, Russia? Hey, colonization successful. Well, let me get... We'll take... Um... Four guys and a cannon. You can be my colonization army. Four guys and a cannon. So how many colonies do we have? Two. Her. I'm tempted to get another one. Because they're pretty cheap and we have a lot of income. We have disposable income. Yeah, let's do another colony. Four guys and a cannon. Let's roll to uh, Pindinga. So get out of Nupe. There you go. It's going to be a little expensive. But that's okay. 
All right, here goes Serbia. Bye bye Serbia. Bye bye. Been nice knowing you, Serbia. You done. You done did exist. Swahili left the coalition against us. That might have been the smartest thing you've ever done, Swahili. You left the coalition. Bye, Serbia. Bye. Bye. And they're gone. Holy war on the Ottomans. Fantastic. We now have all of Illyria, except for Albania. Well, we have most of Illyria. Well, Albanian Crane. Oh, well. That's okay. Austria is still annexing all of his amazing vassals. Oh, you little bastard Austria with all your vassals. So the Ottomans peaced out. Still probably not a bad time to go to war, though. Because, well, he's down to 158. Mm. Who would join me? Oh, everyone would join me. Everyone. The Teutons, Burgundy, Bohemia, the Netherlands, everyone would join. Uh, I think that means we should just do this. So let's just go ahead and declare war. Uh, I don't think we should do a holy war, though. Holy wars are just oof, painful. But the problem with holy wars is you have to really micromanage and win every battle or else you're just going to be fucked. Uh, Russia would invade the Timurids, we would have to fight the Ottomans, and then whoever else joins might help out a little bit. But mainly Russia would keep the Timurids busy. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Let's go ahead and declare war for Corfu. We don't even have to go get Corfu. Okay, and let's up the maintenance. Very good. And where was the revolt? Over here, that's fine. Let's get you another leader. Bingo. Nice leader, actually. Oh, we don't have access through Austria. Come on, Austria. Give me access. There's a good Austria. Who's a good Austria? Who's a good Austria? So who joined? Russia joined. Bohemia joined. The Teutons joined. Looks like everyone joined. Right? Did Burgundy join? Burgundy did not join. Yo, dog. Oh, I can't. Oh, because he's threatened again. Fuck you, Burgundy. What the shit, dude? You keep flipping between threatened and friendly and all this other shit. Gain prestige or lose prestige? Oh, I don't know. That's a tough choice. How about we gain prestige instead of lose prestige? That sounds like it might be a better choice. I'm just thinking outside the box here. Okay, let's bring over an army to Zeta and another army come on over to Serbia or whatever. Just go that way. Uh, the navy looks pretty healed up. Let's go smash some Ottoman navies. We still have our admiral. That's nice. We're at our three out of three max leaders. Oh, there's his navy. Whoa, that's a big navy. 23, 24, 23, 35. I want to fight that with our archipelago frigs. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. Oh, he actually wants to dick around. Well then, if you want to dick around, I'm happy to dick around with you. Where are you, Where are you at, bro-dog? Bro-dog. Gulf of Cyprus. Oh, over here, okay. Yeah, we, we're going to lose that, because we, we, they're trade ships. What do you expect? You want to come in yet, Burgundy? It's going to be a last chance, probably. No, he's just not interested. He's just a total douche. Burgundy the douche. He would help in the defensive war, but not an offensive war. Burgundy the douche. At least Russia joined, right? I mean, that's that's a huge thing. They're going to keep the Timurids super busy. But we do need to end this episode here, so thank you guys for joining me today. I have been Shen. You have been you. It's really disappointing that, the, that Oman annexed the Mamluks, because that means we could not vassalize the Mamluks, so we have no feeder state. There's nobody that we have right now that we can just feed land to. And there really isn't any option for that unless we come down here and make them spit out uh, Byzantium. Or Moria. Or whatever. Anyone who's Greek Orthodox. And then we can feed them anything that is Greek Orthodox, right? 
There's still a few Orthodox provinces over here. Yeah. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.